Oh my god, oh my god. Is that it? Did I make it? Please tell me. What? No! Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Neil and welcome back to some more Beam NG Drive. And in this video, we're going to be taking a look at some scenarios, which we don't do very often, but there was two that uh, really caught my eye that looked really interesting. And the first one is actually on a map we just looked at last week called Rock Heap, which if you don't know is a volcanic motor storm style map that does a really a lot of really awesome stuff. So yeah, we have two available to us, a uh, dead man rolling and fireproof curtain. So I guess we'll start from the beginning with dead man rolling. Now it says, follow the checkpoints as they lead you along a meandering route through a section of the map. So it looks like it's a time trial type event. So yeah, I think, I think I'm pretty good at this map, so I'm not too worried, but let's go ahead and try it anyway. Alrighty, so it says, it is all downhill from here. Track Marshall's announcement. Today your challenge is to FTC. This means follow the checkpoints. Simple, right? The time, this time around, instead of completing a lap, you're going to follow the checkpoints through a section of the map. We're going to we're going to give you the one and only ramrod. Don't worry, we've really pulled out all the stops this time. You have one minute and one second to complete this challenge. Good luck, you're going to need it. Oh, okay, so we have not a lot of time, but we do get the ramrod, which is a pretty goddamn awesome truck. As you can see, it's pretty quick. Although I remember it not being able to turn that well, so hopefully we can actually do pretty good on here. So it's not taking us the direct route of the map. It's kind of taking us... I don't know, a little bit, like, maybe a little bit of a shortcut, or just kind of, like, off the beaten path, but so far, it's pretty easy, but remember, we only have one minute and one second to get to the end through all 13 checkpoints, so I can see how this could be a little bit challenging, but so far, it seems pretty easy, albeit a little bit bouncy, this thing is not the most forgiving vehicle in the world, nor is it the fastest, I would much rather have some sort of rally car, I feel like we could do a lot better with that but so far we're doing pretty good uh we're already on number eight so we might actually be able to do this the first time which would be really really impressive and it would make me look a lot better at this game than i actually am oh shit oh that is a big turn oh no <laughs> oh that was a huge collision wow we still had three left are you kidding me the clock man you gotta watch the clock yes yes i know okay so note to self don't run into the pole at damn near 100 miles an hour. All right, so we're going to try that again, and uh, that is a very, very... That's basically a 90-degree turn, so the only way I can see us actually getting that time is to drift into the turn, kind of like I did, only this time try not to run into the pole. <laughs> kind of makes sense. Going to be difficult, for sure. Ooh, there we go. That was a pretty good turn. We did that quite a bit faster than the last one, I feel. Although I haven't been really watching the clock. We're already at, we've already spent 35 seconds of it though. So we're gonna really need to pick it up here. The, yeah, this this turn up here is gonna be a bastard. I can do it pretty good all the way up to here. Oh, it is nerve wracking going this fast. 100 miles an hour through this turn. But I, I, do, I don't see any other way that we could do this. No, I did it again. No. Oh man. Wow, that screwed up our car. Actually, it looks like the tires are all Okay, we did kill the engine though. Damn. Oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> oh, no. Is this gonna be one of those things where I get really lucky at the beginning and it just all goes downhill from there? Are you kidding me? I crashed not even halfway through. Jesus. All right, a little bit slower into this turn. It can be a bastard. There we go. There we go. Okay, that felt good. That felt good. That might be, that might give me a couple extra seconds of leeway here. But man, this this turn up here is definitely, definitely unholy. Uh, I might not actually be able to do this, guys. This is, they give you no, no. You cannot have any errors at all or you're not gonna make it. So let's try this again and drift into the turn. Drift into the turn, that's not drifting, no! No, and there's the final checkpoint. We would have made that, oh. You know, it almost feels possible now. Okay, I'm gonna give this a couple more tries. And if we don't make it, we don't make it. We have a lot to get to in this video. You know, I almost feel like this particular uh, scenario might be a little bit easier with an actual racing wheel. You have more control over how much the steering wheel is turning because with the uh, the controller, you can only you can only do 
the minute details so much, and it, I feel like, especially on that turn, where you have to drift into it, basically, it would help a lot to have a physical wheel in front of me. I might actually have to try that pretty soon. If you guys want to see uh, some more, we some, like, wheel cam action, like, with an actual steering wheel, let me know down below. And hit that like button while you're there. It helps out a lot. Anyway, here we go. Oh, baby. Into the turn. Oh, that felt good. Oh, that felt really good. Oh, that was... No! No! That was so close! Oh, are you kidding me? Oh. There it is. There it is. There it is. Yes! Oh, this is gonna be a close one. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Is that it? Did I make it? Please tell me. What? No! I was... Point six two seconds too late. No. <laughs> We're moving on. We're moving on. That's that. I can't do that again. I cannot do that again. Jesus. Well, it does say it's a hard difficulty, so I guess that makes sense. This one says hard too, and it's another FTC. Do I want to do this? I got. We gotta try it. You gotta see how hard it is. My god, man. There is no room for air whatsoever. Alright, so we have, uh... We have a minute and ten seconds for this one. And it says, uh, pretty much the same thing. Although it does say you're gonna be driving the Curtis Curtain Mud Plugger. Remember, ground clearance doesn't mean much when the ground is lava. You have a minute and ten seconds to complete this challenge. Okay. Okay, so we have to, we have to not run into the lava, of course, because if you guys remember, if you run into the lava, your car explodes. So we're gonna need to be very careful. Don't worry about the rocks, they're probably not gonna hurt us. And there we go. Oh, wow, it's getting us really in, in close to that fire there, that, that pool of lava. But you know what, it's okay. It's okay, here we go. I, I feel like we're doing pretty damn good. Oh, wait. Oh, no, one of our tires is screwy. Ah, crap. Hopefully it doesn't, uh, hopefully it doesn't affect us too much. I went the wrong way. Oh, man. Yeah, that, that's, that, that's one racked van right there. Yeah, okay, I think I got this down now. I got this. So we need to figure out a way to get through these rocks fast and safely. So, ow, 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 ow. It's okay. Oh, shit! Oh, no, we hit the... F <laughs> well, we might as well throw ourselves into the flames now, go all the way. Yeah, there we go. This completely destroy our van. Okay, wow, this one, I, I feel like this one's not gonna be as hard as the last one, but this one's just more precise, I guess, on where you have to move. But we did get, we do get like 10 more seconds, so. I'm actually not too worried about this at the moment. Okay, we made it. We made it, just don't miss the checkpoints. You missed the checkpoint. Oh my God. Into the flames we go, yet again. <laughs> All right, there we go. We got a good run going this time, and I think I know where I'm going this time. Uh, can we can we take like a shortcut through here? Is what I want to know. I feel like that's gonna be a lot faster. Yes, we can. Beautiful. That's gonna shave off a couple of seconds. Oh God, don't crash. This will be a terrible a terrible time to crash. We already have wasted 40 damn seconds. Okay, where the hell are we going? Oh man, why are we using this tr this giant van? I feel like if we were using like some sort of like covet or something, we'd have a lot better of a time. We're just weaving through all this lava pits of doom. Oh sh shit! No! 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 Keep going, you bastard! Keep it going! Oh, where's the last the last couple checkpoints? Oh, we're not gonna make it. We're not gonna make it. We're not gonna make it. Oh, we're not gonna. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, you know what? We're gonna try this one more time. One more time, and that's it. Go through there pretty good, unscathed. Nicely done, our tires are still okay. Beautiful, oh yes, this is a good run. This is a good run, we just gotta not crash. That's the only thing I'm worried about, not crashing. And we should be a-okay. Good turn, good turn, keep it up. Keep it up, speed it up just a tad. We're going a little bit slow, but that's okay. We're doing it safely. So as long as we can, oh, keep it up. I think we might be okay. Yes, there we go. There we go. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Oh, man, this is nerve-wracking, though. Uh oh Oh, I thought we were about to burst into flames. We didn't, but we, I, I thought we were going to. Okay, okay, we might actually do this. No, 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 no. Come on, come on. Got this. Yes, I think we're going to do it. Oh, shit. 
Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh no, 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 no! No, fuck! Again, within one second! God! <sighs> Those are hard. Those are really hard. Oh yeah, and we're exploding in the background. This is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. All right, so next, uh, I don't think this is supposed to be the next one you're supposed to do, but the trial by fire sounds pretty interesting because it says run across a molten lava lake and the difficulty is easy. So maybe this will actually be a little bit easier. I'm not really sure, but we're going to try it out anyway. All right, so it says, are you a real lunatic? You are. Prove it. Get as much speed as you can and launch yourself across the lava lake. This should be easy. The lava is mostly just slightly molten rocks anyway. You'll slide right across them. Of course, this isn't something you can do halfway. Go big or go home. Good luck. You're going to need it. Share your time on the form. So, if we don't make it, we die. Sounds good, huh? That sounds right up my alley. <laughs> oh, this is going to be crazy. Oh, are we, are we seriously just going to jump across this? Or, or what are we doing here? I'm not really sure. But uh, where's the next checkpoint? There it is. Okay. Okay, I see what's going on here. I see what's going- wait, what? <laughs> what the fuck? What? Are we supposed to blow up? Okay, let's try that again. Because I completely missed the checkpoint, first of all. Alright, what's- what's- what's nail this? It's a very tight space, so we gotta be careful. Oh, yes, there we go, there we go, yeah! So you're supposed to explode. But, um... <laughs> I didn't aim it right. That's the worst place! The worst place to put that checkpoint is right there. Okay, well, so we're about 20 feet away. I think we can do this. It might take a couple tries, but I think we can do this. It's like, uh, what's that game? Oh, shit. It's on the tip of my tongue. The one you play on the ice with the giant uh, things. That you slide across and try to get points, knock other people off. Yeah, it's a giant game of that. Only on lava, not ice. Makes sense, right? Looking good, looking good, looking very good, looking very good. Oh, this might be it. Oh, this might be it. This might be it. Yes! Did we get it? I think we did. Yes. Yes. 21 seconds. There we go, bruh. Gold medal. Finally, we beat one. <laughs> Jesus. It only took, what, what, 20 minutes, 10 minutes? I don't know. Wow. Okay. There's actually quite a bit of, um, quite a bit of scenarios for this thing. So, uh, let's try one that's not an FTC. So, here goes nothing. Super minivan. Uh, complete a lap of rock heap as fast as you can. Oh. Complete or oh, okay, those are just completing whole laps. I gotcha. All right, guys. So because I hate myself, we're gonna do another FTC challenge. This is the Sulfuric Showdown, and it says uh, this time around instead of completing a lap of Rocky, yeah, yeah, yeah. We've given you at least you the least suitable car for this challenge, a supercar. How about that? You have a minute and twelve seconds. So basically, have a we have a car not meant at all for this type of terrain, and we need to get through all the checkpoints as fast as we can so that sounds like an absolute night where the fuck am i going oh messed up already but yeah this is basically the worst car imaginable for this but so far it's actually pretty easy it's a fast car so at least we have that going for us where the hell am i going uh did i miss something here hmm oh it's up there what the f what how am i supposed to get up there all right so you go through this through this, through this one, and then up and over. Okay, that uh is super dangerous, but I get it. It's kind of cool. That was kind of badass, not going to lie. There we go. That might have been the hardest part. Our car is already a little bit uh, screwed up right now, but it is driving fine, so I'm not too worried. And uh, how much time do we have to do this? I wasn't really paying attention to that, but as long as we can keep doing this this way. Oh, buddy. Okay, slow down. There we go. Yeah, we're actually doing this pretty damn good. Okay, I'm guessing we probably have around 45 seconds to a minute to do this. But honestly, this is pretty easy. Oh, careful through the mines. There we go. Okay, where's the next checkpoint? Where are you? There you are. I see you. Oh, God. Oh, God. No, we got a bad bounce. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, we're still okay. We're still okay. Just three more. Just three more. Well, two more, technically. Oh, wow, we must have, like, more than a minute. Okay, well, the, the, they start to get a lot more spread out as you get going, but our car is definitely, definitely not doing too good. Oh, yeah, well, there's no way in hell. No way in hell. Damn it. Okay, well, it actually seems pretty easy. I think we can do this. All right, so far, so good. My car is actually in uh, really, really good shape, actually. So as long as we don't get that bad bounce again, I think we might 
Oh shit, oh shit. We might be in the clear here. Okay, just keep it steady, man. That's all I ask of you. That's all I ask. There we go. There we go. We kept it steady. Okay, we might have a chance now. We might actually have a chance at this one. Ooh, but that time is coming up quick. I think we have like a minute and 10 seconds if I'm not... If I'm, or was it a minute and 20? I'm not really sure. But so far, so... Whoa! No! Oh! <laughs> Shit! Okay. Yeah, um... I still think it's possible, but that bump is an absolute bastard. Okay, we have a we have a minute and 12 seconds. I got you. I got you. We can do this, guys. We can definitely do this. Okay, this one looks good. This one looks good. Yes! Yes, we finally did it! Yes! There we go. Give me that gold, baby. Yes! Woo! It only took like five or six tries, really. That's a lot better than the other ones. So we got that tasty, tasty little gold, and we're going to crash right into the wall. <laughs> oh man, our car was in such good shape too, but we got the gold. That's all I care about, baby. Alrighty, so that is not even half of the scenarios that uh, Rock Heap offers, but most of the other ones were just time trials anyway. But I did all the interesting ones, so I hope you guys enjoyed. If you want to see more scenarios on the channel, let me know down below. And make sure to subscribe if you're not already. And I'll talk to you guys in the next one. See ya.